first exercise we're doing is based around architecture and site. So we'll be going through like a, a series of descriptive exercises where we'll be describing a few things in the area. We'll then um, go into uh, a process of kind of sharing those things and start to kind of extrapolate other things from them. For the history of Katwe, in the colonial times, we had segregation. Nakasero was left for the Europeans, but the Africans, their workers, decided to take residence on Katwe. So what you will see common among Katwe is a low income and slum dwellings. Then you may see also some old houses over the 40s. A writing exercise based on sound. And basically start to create a list of sounds that you can hear. For example, if you find somewhere like over there and there's a one sound that kind of grabs you and you want to just sort of explore that. There are a lot of sounds that are very interesting but because we don't care and we have so many musical sounds going on so we don't realize them. So uh, there's this thing, and I usually hear it uh, when I concentrate, it goes like, or it's always there. Um, I heard the low hum of group uh, like conversation, and I sort of experienced that thing of when you zone, you're, you can zoom in to like understand it, or when you kind of feel like you're honing in, you're like not listening to it anymore, um, whether I was participating in the conversation or not. So I sort of experienced that with my ears. I kept trying to think of ways to describe the sound, but with words. Yeah. So yeah. it would be like a quietly rumbling giggle, because I had written something on that. I don't have much else to say, um, other than, yeah, thank you again. And thank you for inviting me. Yeah.